On May 3rd, Jason Garrett and the Cowboys family gathered to celebrate the career of Dallas's all-time receptions leader, a true coach's dream, Jason Witten. There's nobody I respect more as a person, as a football player, than Jason Witten. It's one of the great givens in all of sports. They say Abdul Jabbar's sky hook was the greatest given. I'll put Witten's Y option against it any day of the week. This is his signature play. He's got over 1,100 catches. Probably half of them are on Y option. We played Detroit in the playoff game. It all came alive on fourth and six. It's going to be fourth down. And Dallas is not taking their offense off the field. Been a while since we won a playoff game. So now people are talking, hey, it's been five years, you know, for these guys. Are they done? This magical season's kind of on the line. It's at the brink. We take a timeout. We're going over what we want to do. And I tell the coaches what they're doing is they're doubling Dez and they're doubling Witten. So these plays that I want are for Terrence and Cole. So we all come up with the two plays. So if I get up to the line of scrimmage and I didn't like the coverage and I could tell based schematically on what they're doing, I'd kill it to the other play. Fourth down and six. Dallas down three at this point and believing it's in four down territory. That's the game right here, bro. If I get up to the line of scrimmage, they give us a completely different coverage than they've been running situationally all game. Romo's yelling out perhaps a protection They're going to double up the outside, so it's going to be Beasley or Witten here. The season's on the line. What am I doing? And I'm like, we're going to call Y option. And that wasn't one of the two plays. So I get up the line, and you'll hear if you can look at the deal. I get up, and I go, Tennessee, Tennessee. That's where Jason Witten went to college. It made you feel like you were on top of the world because he had a belief and you that was bigger than yourself. Fourth and six, Romo Cox and throws it over the middle with 30, 25, 21. What a brilliant call. That's the best call of the year. When the game was on the line, you could bank that ball had a really, really strong chance of going to him because he just saw things the way that I saw them. So he would make decisions that I would have made if I was running that route. Watch the top of this route by Jason Witt. He gives a move to the outside. It's a play that we've probably run more than any play. It's 595 Y option. It was a tribute to the time that those guys spent together running this play, the amount of reps they've had throughout their career. Strong left, act five chip, 595 Y option on one, right? Hey, hey. Boy, there's some. Oh, wit. Just go. Just go high. If you make that choice, go. Because I know what you're thinking. You're thinking is, oh, I lost the route. So you're just kind of slow and stop. And I'm thinking, oh, we'll still make the route work. You know, he can't cover. He, he's not seeing the ball. So if you just run out of it hard, no matter where you are, we're going to be fine. If the guy goes inside, honestly, if the guy's all over you, it doesn't matter. Because I'm just going to throw it. You know, as long as I don't hit him in the helmet. You know, we'd ran that play 10,000 times. Well, Witten hasn't turned in, like, with a guy behind him, maybe in my 14-year career. Boy, Asa! I mean, I think we did it in training camp seven years ago one time. Good job, Witt. Well, Witt's got to kind of do his own deal, though. You know, he's got to just find that opening right. and do In the biggest moment, plan. it came up different than we'd ran it those 10,000 times but the mannerisms of the guy and me doing it and repping it a million times was the reason why I could tell. If it would have been someone brand new doing that, I'd have thrown it on an outcut. Tony is the smartest football player I ever played with. 99 out of 100 times I break out on that. For him, it was not only did he see it, it was I have to wait in a way that only he can do it. And just was a second late in getting to Tony Romo. I could feel Sue. He's kind of getting closer. I'm getting ready to throw to him on this outbreak. And then he comes back in. And when he does it, I'm like, And he was wide open. I mean, it was a perfect decision, perfect deal. And that's why you work hard every day. So that way in the big moment, it just seems natural.
The Cowboys would go on to give Jason Garrett his first playoff win as a head coach, thanks in large part to Y-Option, the signature play of a singular talent.